effectively we communicate with stakeholders, we start with the five steps of communications where you can highlight, for example, okay, so there is a situation where the project wasn't be able to move forward due to different voices and opinions around stakeholders. What I did back then was I made sure all the information regarding our project was presented in a transparent way to really get the visibility for everyone to understand the problem or the challenging uh, points of the project. What I did was I communicate effectively with stakeholders in a manner that works best for them, which means I actively listened to their opinions, seek to understand why, why they think this way, why they suggest this way over that way. I would provide feedback to stakeholders on how their interests and issues are addressed and resolved which means I active listened, I understood why, where they're coming from, and I provide feedback and uh, trying to address and resolve the issues. This is how you act as a leader and really showcasing your empathy in listening to people, respect their thoughts, understand where they're coming from and what you did, your actions was around providing feedback, how their interests and issues are addressed and resolved. So this is how you did in order to solve the problem. But the last step of a effective communication you can highlight in your action point is after providing feedback, you also keep a careful record, which means you document the um the communications let's say we document into a file or somewhere to really have um the documentation um to look back um what we agreed on to make sure everyone has that visibility and understanding of what we agreed what we document in solving the problem of that project so documentation is also very important in order to in order to organize your work um, better and also provide transparency for other stakeholders so these five steps are also really good uh, reference for you to structure your action points in dealing with a difficult time or a difficult conflict with your stakeholders and also highlights your communication skill set and your leadership in general.